you're a member you know you're a returning subscriber thank you for always watching my videos and in today's video it's gonna be a vlog we are not cooking today I hope you have noticed we are traveling and I'm traveling with my babies to Nanyuki and I really wanted to carry you guys along with me and we're traveling on Saturday today is on today is on Thursday yeah so I've been packing because I've realized that I need to start you know packing early because i'm packing for four people and tomorrow which is on friday i'm going to be like super super busy so i wanted to show you guys so guys this is bag number one this one uh, has my clothes and my eldest son i have here actually three bags this is bag number one this is bag number two and this is bag number three so in this bag i have my clothes and my eldest son's clothes and then this one uh, i have clothes for the other two boys and then this one is is empty but i'm going to use it to pack you know uh, fragile stuff like my laptop my tripod uh, a few things that i feel are breakable that i cannot pack in this other bag so i know you're wondering why i have so many bags but I'm packing for four so every time I pack I try to pack as light as possible but I always fail because I also have some clothes here that I'm trying to fit into these two bags but it's impossible this one is even the zipper is almost like tearing as you can see so I think I'm just gonna have to go with these three bags over here yeah so I wish these clothes would actually just fit into these other bags because I really need to carry them. These are my swimming costumes that I need, but I know I won't be able to use them because Nanyuki is quite cold uh, during this time. So I don't think I'll really pack them if there's no space. So I was a little bit hesitant about traveling during these uh, pandemic times because I was feeling like it wasn't like the greatest idea. But so far after a few consultations asking around and then i realized that life is too short or life is too short like when you get the opportunity to do stuff you gotta do them but right now if you're traveling you have to travel smart you have to sanitize you have to wear your mask i think that is what i'm just going to do because i really have to go this trip has to happen like i don't have any other option so Tomorrow being Friday, I have uh, errands to run. I'll be going to town. I have to go buy foodstuffs in the market. I think I'll go to city market so that when I'm from town, I just finish up everything. Yeah. So I'll be going to town tomorrow to buy foodstuffs and then I'll go to city market to buy some fish. Yeah, so I think those are the plans I have for tomorrow. But otherwise, I'm so happy because I'm almost done with parking. And I decided to do this because today... I did a lot of laundry and then I did packing but I'm so happy I'm so happy that like I've actually accomplished something most of the time I always pack when I'm traveling like the next day and it's super hectic because you always have errands you always have places to go when you're traveling the following day so at least I've avoided that so tomorrow after um, when I get from town all I will have to do is just uh, finish up whatever is left out and continue and continue with uh, with other stuff like pack other stuff not packing of clothes yeah so I think that's all for today I think I'll see you guys probably tomorrow if I actually get 
the time to do uh, a video for you guys otherwise if i don't see you guys tomorrow i'll be able to see you on saturday which is the day that we are actually traveling to nanyuki guys uh i wasn't able to like uh, record a video yesterday because i had like such a busy day so today is saturday we are about to leave i'm just waiting for the driver to come and pick us up actually we are going to trm where we are going to get another driver who's going another car with another driver who's going to take us to nanyuki so what we're doing now is just to wait on the driver because i think everybody's ready travis are you ready yeah yeah where is Tavi? Tavi, are you ready Hi. are you ready uh, <laughs> tulani Subscribe. tulani is already wearing his mask are you ready yes are you ready Subscribe. for the trip yes yeah so if you're watching and you have not subscribed kindly hit the subscribe button so i don't know if i'll be able to record anything yesterday i had like such a hectic day i was supposed to uh, take you through everything that i bought yesterday but apparently i didn't get time maybe we'll go through them when we get to nanyuki but right now we're just waiting on the driver we're about to leave everything is packed three hours later you're upset why travis is lying that the driver is coming Ma okay, don't worry, we'll go. We'll go in a bit, huh? Mm. Mm, don't cry. Mm. Okay? Mm. Now wipe your face. Your eyes. Are they dry? Are they dry? Mm. Hmm? Mm. Maybe check. That's how you check. They are dry. Lost my best friend to 23 She left her body and hovered above me I saw no shadow, I looked around Searched every building and home that I found I saw no shadow, but felt a glow The warmth inside me kept me afloat Feel the waves cut through me Hypnotized By the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Get me close, collide Hold tight, hold tight Hold tight Dripping lights Paint the skies All because of you So guys, I just wanted to let you know that we arrived safely and we are so happy. I'm so grateful to God. I'm sorry I have to do this video here in the bathroom because apparently my room doesn't have like enough lighting. You won't even be able to see my face. So 
The next thing I have to do now is just unpack and then I'll call the two gentlemen, give them a bath and then probably uh, also take a shower, take the boys downstairs to have dinner and then probably just go to bed because we are so exhausted like whew, we are so exhausted but because you're a mom you still can't stop and then you'll play tomorrow yes yeah get some sleep and then you guys are gonna play tomorrow Cindy. yes yeah now you're tired you've showered you've eaten tomorrow is another day Cindy. yes okay to learn you are you happy huh you're sad Hmm? Mm -hmm. Why are you sad? No, it's not fair. It's not fair what? See, you guys have been playing. You'll play tomorrow again. Sindio? Hmm? Tomorrow you try and wake up early and then you go and play. Sour? Because I also want to go and shower now. The next day. So it's really quiet here. It's really nice and green and quiet. You can actually... Uh, you can actually view uh, white animals from where I am here, where I'm standing here, because right in front of me over there, there are some zebras and some warthogs. Yeah, you can actually just see them. They come here in the morning to graze, and they're always just here most of the time. The antelopes, I don't know. Yeah, the monkeys. The monkeys are always here in the morning, and they're always like really a nuisance like you can't leave the windows open because they'll come in and they'll enter your pantry and they'll eat everything and they'll tear everything and they'll poop everywhere like it's just that is the crazy thing about this place like you can never leave your windows open but otherwise it's really nice and peaceful and you can actually spend a really nice quiet time over here and in the evening you can actually just go for walks we haven't actually gone for a walk yet because it's only day two but i hope like in the coming days we're gonna go for our walks because we want to lose some weight but i really love this place it's actually really serene and really beautiful like it's really beautiful like i, I could live here for the rest of my life given the chance to... so i wanted to share with you guys how amazing this place is those there are zebras. I'm trying to be so quiet so that I don't spook them out. But those ones over there are zebras. Those ones over there are zebras, uh, antelopes, and a warthog. I don't know if you guys it's so windy I don't know if you'll be able to hear me but they're all staring at me like what are you doing so you get to connect with nature so beautiful so amazing <laughs> so weird so so weird how they're lo all looking at me Hi, Wonder Woman. Oh, excuse me. Ooh, yes. Look at that booty. <laughs> Open eye. Feel the waves cut through me Hypnotized By the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Chemicals collide Hold tight, hold tight Hold tight Dripping lights Paint the skies All because of you Dripping lights Oh
told you guys before uh, some of the things you can do here in old Vegeta is go for walks as you can see there's actually nobody on the road back there I left uh, the zebras and the, the antelopes and the white dogs the house is not even far like the house is over there but I'm gonna show you where you get to see the elephants I don't know if I'll be able to see them today but I'm on my way there just to be able to show you guys the house is just over there so let's see if we can see some other animals because sometimes we get to see elephants on this fence which is electric you cannot actually even touch the fence because it's electric you're gonna get electrocuted let me see if we're gonna be able to see some of them here today so there's nobody here on the road I'm here alone nobody So guys, here is where you get to see the the lions and the elephants. Apparently today they are not here, but probably on the next vlog I'll be able to show you guys. I can only see antelopes. Yeah, only antelopes here today. I wish I'd gotten the elephants too here. I don't know they're not here today but when you come here on this fence it's electric I can see a rhino over there that's a rhino there are rhinos over there there are antelopes I was hoping to see an elephant and a lion because at night we can hear them roaring like you can hear it loud and clear at night because the house is actually not very far so I can only see a rhino and antelope and the house is right over there so you can see it's not very far so I hope next time when I come here I'll be able to see at least uh, an elephant or a lion I can only see a rhino today there's a car there I think I'm gonna have to end the vlog here. I really do hope that you guys enjoyed the video from Nairobi to Nanyuki. We are at Old Pejeta and uh, if you ever wanna come here, I would like to recommend it. It's really beautiful as you have seen on the vlog. And I just wanna end the video here. So if you are not subscribed, kindly hit the subscribe button. And don't forget to share this video with your friends. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. And I really do hope that I'll be able to see you guys on my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Every time we say goodbye, they all see that it's a lie.